Hi guys, welcome to another A1 video walk round. It's a lovely day today, isn't it, Samantha? It's very nice indeed. Yeah. Uh, but the day is about to be lovelier because we're uh, going to introduce this to the lovely people out there. Okay. What a ripper. What a ripper. What very is it? Very much like this. Not normally a three door fan. This is pretty cool. This is an exception, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, okay, Samantha Panther. Uh, what are we going to do? We're gonna, you can show them around the outside? Yeah. I'll tell them a little bit about the car while you're doing that. Obviously, all from my memory. Yeah, absolutely, not prompted. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> then we'll take them inside, then we'll take them for a quick ride, uh, which will be thrilling. Thrilling. Uh, and then that'll be it. Okay. Should we do it? Yeah. Let's do it. Let's go. Oh, this has new tyres all around this, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Certainly has. Had all the wheels uh, powder coated. Yeah. Never really done properly. Uh, so we've got here VW Golf, 2 litre TDI, Blue Motion Tech, GTD, hatchback 3 door, the DSG Auto Gearbox, Twin Clutch, Super Duper. Super this Duper. Is, this is a Euro 6, Sam. It certainly is. What's that mean? That means you can drive into London without... Or Birmingham. Oh yeah, or Birmingham, or Bath, and Bristol, Super wherever now, without being charged an absolute fortune yeah. and not for it. Either. Yeah. Uh, it's a 1616 plate, just on 36,000 miles, Sam. Yep. In silver. But it's a, it, I really love this silver, and what we've done with the black on it as well, this looks proper cool, because it's kind of a, what, a silvery grey platinum? Yeah, it's really nice, actually. It's like a platinum it. colour, isn't it? Yeah, it's really, really rare, but in the sunlight, it definitely looks very silver, and then when the sun dips down a bit, it just changes colour a little bit. Fantastic yeah, it's colour, very really nice. Rare. Uh, okay, full, def, full VW service history, Samantha. Yep. Uh, and plus we'll do a uh, cam belt and DSG service. Right. Nice people we are. We are indeed. Did you know this was the 184PS as well? Is it? Yeah, that means it goes like beep. <laughs> no 60, seven and a half seconds. Very nice. 142 miles an hour. 180 brake horse, just over actually. 280 pounds of torque in a golf. Love that. Uh, but this is where you get the chisel nizzle. Urban driving, 50 miles to the gallon. Extra urban. Or combined 60. And out of town, 65 miles to the gallon. Very nice. Which, to be fair, is fully believable because VW have never done anything uh, unreputable with their figures, have they? Absolutely not. They are straight down the lines, the Germans, aren't they? <laughs> yeah. Anyway, I digress a little bit because it is a great car. Um, it is a very good car. I just don't like people that aren't very uh, truthful. Yeah. Why do you do that? Don't know. Just shoot down the hip. Yeah. Uh, right, let's go inside. Okay. So, Samantha. Yes. I'm going to need a break horse, yeah? Mm. Yeah. That's what they call it. That's what they call 184. it. 184. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, right, so really reliable two litre VW TDI engine. It's uh, very rarely go wrong. So we're going to do the cam belt and the water palm. I think it's got a water palm this one. I have to double check. Yeah. We'll do that before. Uh, well, traffic just come past here, Sam. Yeah, what is this? The M25? I mean, do they not know we're doing a video? <laughs> They've obviously not seen our hundreds of thousands of viewers, have they? Nope. Cruel. Uh, right. Let's have a look at the boot. Big boot. It's got a big boot. I do like a big boot myself. Smaller boot. Yep. Put all the gear in there. Yep. Uh, so I'm going to point out a little few things on this one. Okay. Uh, it's got some black detailing on it. It's grey. Privacy glass, grey. Uh, not a pano, yeah. but sunroof, opening sunroof. Yeah, lovely. Look at those Audi, Audi uh, VW pano roofs have a few issues, don't they? Yeah, they do. They're all good with the sunroof. Perfect. Uh, Vienna leather. Heated seats. Opening roof, as I say, with sunshade. Um, yeah, it's got quite a lot of gear on it. Yeah. I did nice. notice it's all got the different driving modes on as well. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I chucked it into sport earlier. Right, uh, Panther. 
So we've got your electric heated and folding wing mirrors. Yeah. Electric windows. Auto lights, Auto lights. flappy paddles. Do you yeah. like flappy paddles? I've never used really, I've, that's a lie, I've used them once. I've never used it since. What's the point? Pointless. Yeah. Pointless. Uh, so you can do it on there, you can do it on there, stick shift as well, but you're just going to use it auto-wise really. You've got the GTD interior, GTD steering wheel. Um, it's got, that's quite cool actually, laser guided cruise control. Yeah, um, Yeah, cruise control, all your DAB, Bluetooth, music streaming. Um, it's got parking sensors. Is it all round? Uh, let's have a look. Let's have a look. I can't remember. Two, yep, on the front too, yep. Um, it's got, it does say heated seats? Yeah, you have. I did, yeah. didn't I? Yep. Yeah, I'm mad, didn't I? Um, that's about it, really. Oh, auto dimming lights, auto wipers, auto lights, auto. What do we call it? Uh, oh, um, anti dazzle, yeah, Love mirror, that. yeah. In a glasser. In a glasser yeah. mirror. You get the old dazzle dazzle, didn't you? Certainly do, yeah. Uh, okay, I think that's about it, Samantha Panther. Should we go for a drive? Yeah, let's go. Let's do it. Okay, Sam, are you uh, ready for a ride? I certainly am. Okay, do you know what I'm going to do? What are you going to I'm going to put it in sport, and I'm going to put the gearbox in sport. Lovely. Uh, do you know why? Why? So I'm just that sporty type of guy, you know? Yeah. 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 Oh, man. His uh, hair con is nice at the moment. Yeah, it certainly is. Okay, so you know what I'm going to ask you. I ask you every video. You do. You're going to ask me what the competition is. Yeah, what is the competition on one of these? So we were just having a little chat, weren't we? We so, were. Um, what, what did we say? It's up there with the BMW 1.3 120D. Yeah, 125D even, 125, yeah. Yeah, um, uh, the A, A2, Mercedes A2, what did you say? Yeah, A220, these AMG Sport lines. Yeah. But there isn't really... I'm just going to try that gearbox out of sport again because it revs up. Um, there isn't an awful lot I would say. Probably the BMW, um, maybe the say it lay on, but that's just a golf just in slightly shittier clothes. Yeah. Um sorry, hang on. Um so there isn't really a lot in a diesel in a hatch that lives with the GTD because it looks like a GTI. Yeah. Drives like a GTI. Yeah. And these engines are wicked. They are really Still U less compatible. Yeah. Um, so, and they do, so, like, uh, compared to the GTI, which they're similar performance wise, they uh, do so much more fuel economy. Right, I'm just. <laughs> <laughs> that is talky. A 60 gone. 70. I mean. Effortless. Rapid, isn't it? Yeah. Drop that back out of sport. Um, so, what I'm getting in here, I'm not showing off the size of my ears. We know they're massive. Very quiet. Very quiet. Yeah, very, very quiet. And how comfy are these leather seats? Super comfy, yeah. Because these are rare, right? This Vienna leather, sunroof, heat seat, that's all rare stuff, yeah? Yeah, really rare. Plus, it's got the bad boy wheels. Bad boy wheels, yeah. Um, and it's done 35, 36,000 miles, which is. Tiny. It's like a brand new car. Yeah, it does. It drives very well. It drives wicked, man. You can tell when these cars have been battered about. Um, apparently, the guy who traded it in for a four series Grand Coupe, isn't it? Yeah. Wanted a bit more room for his golf clubs and his golf yeah, cart. Yeah. yeah. Uh, he bought it from a main dealer who said uh, it was from a, an old deer who'd specced it up. Yeah. And just hadn't done any mileage in it, really. So come on, let's give it some beats. Doesn't it go? It sounds nice too. It does sound nice for a D. Yeah. Oh, I've really got to slow down there. <laughs> I nearly nearly broke the speed limit there. Yeah. Nearly. And we don't break the speed limit, right? Definitely not. No. It's against the law. Yeah, it is, yeah. Uh, and at A1 car search, we're uh, above board at all times. Yeah, law abiding Just remember that, kids. So, I think to sum up, if you want a, a hot little hatch or run around or a motorway muncher something that looks super cool it's probably even cooler because we've just driven it yeah uh, gonna be super reliable great warranty package all that kind of stuff really well prepped that car's mint the back seats and they've never been sat in yeah well if they have
you won't sell, buy someone with a ma you know massive ass because <laughs> they don't look like they've been no, kicked exactly. about at all. And you can normally tell getting in and out. There's like scuff marks in and out. Yeah. None of that. Um, so yeah, if you want that and you want to buy it off the best company in the world, come and buy ours. Okay. If you don't, you can't buy some other pile of rubbish somewhere else. Yeah. Woo. Hey guys. <laughs> it's quite quick in there. It certainly is. Oh, a little handling first. There we go, right. Let's, uh, you can't get to the can't stop button, can you? No. Pinned her to the side. <laughs> right, see you later. Thanks for watching. Hi guys, I uh, hope you've enjoyed your video so far. We're just going to spend a couple of minutes just telling you what we give away as a um, RAC approved dealer and basically what package you get from A1. Uh, Samantha's behind the camera again, she's going to fire a few questions at me and I'll just explain what we, what we do. Perfect, so we're just going to start off with why should a customer buy from A1 and what makes us different? Well, I think probably the customer service we give is second to none. By all means, go on to Google, check out our reviews. If you're on Auto Trader, check out our reviews there and you'll see a bit about what we do. We're a family run business, been going nearly a couple of decades and uh, we just give really good service and we prepare cars to a very, very high standard. What does it mean to be RAC approved and what is included in the sale? Well, being an RAC approved dealer, we inspect every vehicle to RAC standards. So it goes through a pre-delivery inspection that's very vigorous. And if anything needs doing um, where it doesn't hit those standards, it obviously gets uh, done prior to sale. Uh, you get a, a RAC warranty, RAC breakdown, cover for a year and um, you can extend the warranty from six months all the way up to three years that is a platinum warranty uh, which is the best we can give away and um, you also get uh, a year's MOT if the car hasn't been serviced within four uh, is due a service within four months or four thousand miles we'll also do that prior to the sale. What finance packages does A1 offer? So finance wise we generally use close motor finance we do use um, Motor Novo as well. Uh, the rates are as good as we can buy, um, and we don't put any e anything extra onto the rates at all. We just give you what the finance company gives us. You can have PCP uh, if a car's up to five years old or sixty thousand miles. Straight HP. We do leasing and lease purchase and hire purchase, and there's very various different uh, finance deals out there. But we'll tailor make it to what you need. Does A1 provide after sales care for their customers? Yeah, we certainly do. If you're local to us in Sussex, um, we've got a lot of Brighton based customers and a lot of people around, obviously, Burgess Hill and Hayward Heath. So, yeah, we do uh, servicing, MOTs, repairs, um, bodywork repairs, detailing, all of that kind of stuff. Uh, and I think, Sam, have we covered everything? I think so. I think that's pretty much it. If you've got any more questions, just give us a call. Thanks very much. Thanks for watching.